guys, it's me. I'm back on here to do a quick little video, um, quick-ish video, <laughs> of what um, my makeup collection is right now. Um, since I'm a mom and I've moved and we bought our own house and all this other stuff. Yeah, there's a lot that I don't have and I, <laughs> I just, I'm a very simple makeup person in general. So simple is the better, but let's get right into it. I'm filming in my guest bedroom. So this will be the bed that I sleep on when my new baby comes. <laughs> um, so we're pretty much in the new baby's room, which if it's a girl, which we think it is because the lady said she was 70% sure that it's a girl. Um, so her name will be Savannah Gray. Um, now my husband, you know him, he still wants to hope on to that 30% that there's a boy. So uh, if it's a boy, we will be naming it James Sawyer. So that'll be fun. Anyway, let's get right into it before I blabber and blabber and blabber. Okay, so basically I'm just going to go through the face. Uh, that's all I pretty much have today. Uh, I'll be doing some swatches and stuff like that, so it'll be interesting. <laughs> uh, so I have my NYX. Uh, wow, I can't even think right now, ladies. <laughs> my NYX eyeshadow primer. Um, beige. So nothing too special about it. And then I have, let's go into these, um, my color tattoo uh, from Maybelline. Um, I have this gold one that's really kind of pretty. So this gold right here, look at it. Whoop. Gold. Wow, you cannot see anything. Ugh. I need lighting, girls. <laughs> I don't know. This this room's great, but I don't know. It's just I need more light. I need brighter light or something. I'm not sure. Um, and then you know my barely branded. Uh, it's just a beige cream. Um, I put that on my on uh, my uh, lid a lot of the times. Um, and then I have this silver. Um, this is kind of fun, um, it's a basic silver, ladies. It's really um, more of like, I use it like a glitter, but it works. Um, and then, so let's go into my other eyeshadows. So I have this Love in Rio from NYX. And it's a white, like a, like a, what is that color? Like a bronzy kind of, no, no, it's more like a gun metal. Like, and then there's a matte brown and then there's like the, the creamy white. Um, I use this, um, I've had it for a little while, but honestly you can't even tell um, that I've used it quite a bit um, because it's, it's quick it's right there your eye looks right there it's done so that's insane and then of course my almost my one number one go-to makeup look when I was first starting out and doing all this makeup and stuff like that uh, knock on wood from wet n wild I've hit pan <laughs> ladies I love this um, it's their color trio it's that red kind of mauve and then a brown and then this pinky little shade really pretty really simple using a baby wipe ladies <laughs> um and then uh one of their eight that i love um it's the comfort zone wet and wild um this one broke how many times have i moved ladies how many Probably my daughter dropped it probably three times. Um, it's got like the greens kind of on this side. I use the green, but I don't really use much anymore. And then this is like a really go-to eye. So it's a cream, it's a pinky, and then it's a brown go-to eye look. So 
pretty simple. See, I'm pretty simple. <laughs> um, and then I do have the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. Um, and this just recently scared the crap out of me when we moved into this house and I went to go open it. Yeah. I'm so sad. <laughs> I'm still using it, but it scares the crap out of me. Um, my husband is now calling. So what I was talking about is my chocolate bar palette when I moved. This one broke, um, and the, it was the highlighter shade, and it broke, and it just colored the whole palette. I'm still trying to clean it and use it because I barely have touched this thing, and I love it. So, oh, please, <laughs> come back to me. Okay, and then uh, I have my Stay Mount Rimmel uh, Foundation, uh, the Mousse, and in Light Ivory. Uh, my daughter has played with it, as you can tell. Uh, the concealer that I just got, uh, the Fergie Wet n Wild line in Fair. Love this. These are my makeup brushes that I have. I literally do not have much. This is all I have. Uh, so I have a stippling brush from Real Techniques that actually has broken as well. Uh, my husband tried to squish it back together. Yeah, let's hope that stays for a little while. Um, then I have the just big powder brush from a line of 16 that I got uh, a while back ago. Um, they don't have any names or anything like that. Um, my blush brush, it broke. <laughs> uh, eyeshadow brush, just a flat little eyeshadow brush. Um, and then I have, I do have a set of four. Sony Kashuk brushes, which I love. Uh, the Sony Kashuk little eyeliner brush. The contouring brush, nice angled, little fluffy, very nice. The angled eyeshadow brush. And then the fluffy brush. Love those. And then I do have a little uh, black uh, angled eyeliner brush. Um, this is for when I want to do like the big weaned cat eye look. <laughs> um, I do have the Tarte, uh, what was this one? Lights, Camera, Lashes. This is a good one, ladies. Um, and okay, so finishing off the face, I have the Fit Me Maybelline. Um, what is this? Light pink blush. Um, I'm I barely wear blushes, ladies, um, because I'm kind of scared <laughs> to see. I'm very white, very tan. I'm very, like, nothing. I have no pigmentation. I am whiter than white. <laughs> so it scares me to try new things. And um, especially, like, on my face. I don't want to look like a clown. So this is a very soft. It doesn't even come up on my finger, but it's a very soft pink, um, so it's nice. And then I do have the NYC Smooth Face Bronzing Face um, in, what was this, Sunny? And, of course, this broke. <laughs> How many things do I have that are broken? <laughs> okay, uh, this is what I uh, contour with and put bronzer on because... I don't have a contouring kit, so this I guess is both. <laughs> um, I do have the NYX uh, HD Studio Photographic Finishing Powder. Love this stuff. Love this stuff. Um, completely almost out of it. It scares me. Um, it's in the Pure Mineral, um, just the white, and I love that it makes me stay matte all day and I have very oily skin so it's matte like and it t-zones nothing no cakiness no nothing it's fabulous and then um I'm using like as a daily one right now the hard candy fast and fabulous translucent translucent I cannot speak finishing powder um and I just hit pan a little while ago <laughs> And then the one lip product. I have one lip product, ladies. That's kind of sad. I think it's sad. But I don't.
don't do lip products that much because my husband's like, look, if I kiss you or if I can't kiss you and something gets on my lips, I got a problem with it. <laughs> he's a very country boy. <laughs> so he's like, look, when I want to kiss you, I want to kiss you. So why can't I kiss you right now? Like, oh, but there's something on my lips. <laughs> no. <laughs> so anyway, uh, the Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stain. And it is in the color 20 Love Stick. So it's this beautiful pink. This beautiful pink. And it is so, like, just perfect. Um, and, it, and it stains and then it never comes off. Nothing. Transferred nothing. My daughter just woke up. So anyway, um, I'm glad because I'm done with this video. So I will um, let me know what you want to see in the comments down below, please. Um, I'm wearing this today. I'm wearing the orange and the brown. And I got this new shirt. It's a very outgoing color. So my friend got it for me and I'm testing it out. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.